Hi, it's Patrick Hudson from intensivecareathome.com.au where we provide tailor-made solutions for long-term ventilated adults and children with tracheostomy by improving their quality of life and where we also provide tailor-made solutions to hospitals and intensive care units to save money and resources whilst providing quality care. In last week's blog, I shared an article published by the ABC website last month and the article revealed that the majority of Australians are not dying the way they want to. The Grattan Institute report finds as care becomes more institutionalized. You can check out last week's blog and last week's article by clicking on the link below this video. In this week's blog, I want to talk about from and with high-tech medicine to high-touch intensive home care services. As you are well aware, the number of long-term ventilated adults and children with tracheostomies is increasing. The number of intensive care units who continue to block beds because of the increased length of stay of long-term ventilated patients in intensive care units is increasing as well. The minimal number of service providers in the community who already provide a skimmed down version of services to long-term ventilated adults and children with tracheostomy is also telling us that they can't cope and that they can't provide the services that are needed in the home to provide the quality of life long-term ventilated adults and children with tracheostomies and their families need and deserve. Also, the services that are needed in the home to continuously keep long-term ventilated adults and children with tracheostomies out of intensive care and keep them at home. This is mainly due to the fact that most service providers don't work with critical care trained nurses like intensive care at home does and they are also not accredited to provide intensive home care nursing services which is needed to provide quality of life for patients and their families. In fact, most community service providers who already look after long-term ventilated adults and children with tracheostomies don't have the skills and the resources to provide the quality of life long-term ventilated adults and children with tracheostomies and their families need and deserve. Those service providers also don't directly approach intensive care units and help them to minimize their costs and free up their expensive, precious and scarce intensive care beds. They also often cite the lack of support, the lack of resources and the lack of clinical skills as one of their main challenges. One way out of the dilemma is to provide high-touch intensive home care nursing services that is able to combine the high-tech requirements needed for somebody who is ventilator dependent with tracheostomy. This can only be done with a service like intensive care at home that is accredited against Australian healthcare standards and more importantly who has the right mindset and who has people on board who have experience with intensive care at home services. This not only provides patients and families with an improved quality of life, it also provides intensive care units with massive cost savings and frees up their expensive and scarce intensive care beds that can be used for other, more acutely unwell patients. A high touch approach is needed for long term ventilated adults and children with tracheostomy and this high touch approach is best being delivered in a home care environment with critical care trained nursing staff and it provides a genuine alternative to a long term stay in intensive care. What are your thoughts? Do you think that a combination of high tech medicine in intensive care to a high touch home care environment can provide a better and improved quality of life for long term ventilated adults and children with tracheostomies and their families? I would be really interested in your thoughts and experiences. Leave a comment on the blog. Please also note that Intensive Care at Home has been selected as a preferred provider for Queensland Health Services as part of the recent Hospital in the Home tender. 
You can also contact me on 041-094-2230 if you want to know more about how we can help you, your intensive care units, or your patients and families, or if you are a family member, how we can help your loved one. Thank you for tuning into this, this week's blog. This is Patrick Hutzel from intensivecareathome.com.au and I'll see you again in another update next week.